So first one, you're going to be from compressed ready. And you're going to drive out and do two to the head. Two to the uh, head box. All right, you ready? Stand by. the center target head box from the holster. tell you right off the bat running wise you didn't flag anything but you ran like in between USPSA and real like tactics. so you ran when you went to retreat you ran like this yeah and that's not a good way to run with a gun because you're taking for granted that there's nothing over there that you want to flag the gun so you're either going to shoot here and keep that gun back like you're shooting USPSA or you can retreat like this or if you want to do real world shit you can retreat gun down like this and then when you get to where you're going, you have to be very careful that you turn and come up this way. Not that you do what I, like USPSA will teach you a bad habit of keeping the gun level and doing things. Because you flag everything. So it'll be very much run, guns down, trace around the gun and bring the gun up to where you're going. Make sense? So try that. Don't shoot it again, but just run with the gun out. That way you can feel Good, much better. You're ready. Ready. Stand by. Good. 7.87. 7.87. Okay, so for this one, last time you were about, you actually didn't do too bad at this one. One thing I'm gonna show you with support hand, if I know I'm gonna draw and shoot support hand only, I'm actually gonna turn my body towards what I wanna shoot. So like I can start here and I can draw and I'm gonna step forward and then I'm gonna shoot like this. And the reason being, I'm gonna try and keep the gun as straight up and down, I don't necessarily wanna be like this. And you'll find that tension where over gripping makes the dot go nuts. And then where like that perfect tension, the dot will just kind of float and you're not gonna be able to keep it stable. So you're just trying to get good trigger press on this. It's supposed yeah. to be, Good slack out, sights where you want it, and catch that sight right, right where you want it. This is a, like you should be doing this same drill pace, right? But stepping forward and then boom, boom. Make sense? Yeah. Nice and clean, clean, and clean, 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 clean. All right. Good. 295, we'll run a little bit low, but we'll call it good. I call this dragging yourself out of a position, right? 
So as I'm shooting, right, I draw out one, two. I'm gonna take this right target because that's the easiest one for me to like pull me towards my next position, right? Okay. So the way I'm gonna work this is I'm gonna do nice clean draw, bring the gun to it, one, two, three, four. And then you're gonna see as I get to this last target, three, four, I'm already leaning towards where I wanna go, all right? Then think about this. There is no huge purpose from this distance that I'm moving to have the gun reloaded while I'm at like a full sprint. I mean, yeah, you wanna get it done, but you don't need to be like done by this point, right? What's primary is like, hey, I'm moving. I wanna get the gun back up and running, but I don't need to rush the reload. So again, what this looks like is if we over rush it, right? So one, two, Three. Right, I'm rushing, ah, you know, and I do this a lot in competition. Doesn't make sense. I need to be done by a certain point. I know what that, that point is. So instead, I'm gonna go one, two, three, and just get the gun like relaxed enough so I can focus on my movement across. Yep. Make sense? So try not to stress yourself about like, oh my God, I need to be reloaded down right away. Right. Like, no, from here to like in here, it's a very generally acceptable amount of time to get that gun reloaded because you're moving, right? You're running. Yeah. So this is doing this and you're trying to like link them up. So once you get it out, take a second to like sh and eyeball it in so you know it's in and then get to your position. the draw the closer that I can get the more get ground I can cover while I'm drawing the closer I am to the target to take my shots oh, right shit. yeah so like when I go to draw I don't actually just want to like and then start shooting right what I really want to do is if you watch it you want to start off to a little bit of a sprint right so like as that buzzer's waiting I want to try and get as close as I can to that first target when that buzzer sounds to be like boop and then slow myself down so I cover a little bit more distance it's the difference between me shooting here and me shooting up there, right? You still need to be relaxed behind it. And this is a really frustrating demonstration because I'm trying to get used to this fucking holster. But um, as it goes, right, I want to be here. Yeah, like that's going to get me so much closer to where I need to be. Make sense? Yeah. yeah. All right. Over the distance during the draw. Yes.